Good afternoon. Welcome, everyone. Uh, my name is Lisa Goddard. As uh, Lou mentioned, I am the director of IRI, which is the International Research Institute for Climate and Society. Uh, IRI is one of the largest institutes within Columbia's Earth Institute and, and the only one that's specifically devoted to the, the science of climate, linking climate information uh, for decision making. Uh, I've been given this opportunity to make a few opening remarks and, and I'd like to use my short time. Uh, first of all, to very much, uh, well, myself and also on behalf of Earth Institute and, and Jeff Sachs to thank C4 for their vision and leadership in shaping this event. We're very excited to be part of it. Um, I'd also like to thank uh, our very distinguished uh, panel of speakers for this afternoon. I think it's shaping up to be a really exciting and interesting event. I'd also like to use a few minutes to tell some of you who may not be so familiar with IRI uh, a little bit about us and why, we're, why this event is so important to us. Uh, we were founded uh, almost 20 years ago by NOAA. Uh, since then, we've uh, grown quite a bit. We now have over 15 uh, funding partners, uh, NOAA and USAID being prominent among those. Um, we've established uh, an international group of the Climate Services Partnership, which is really uh, at this forefront of the community of practice in bringing uh, science in, uh, into action, and especially in climate-related, climate-sensitive decisions. So our mission uh, remains to this day to enhance society's capability to uh, understand, anticipate, and manage the impacts of climate for the improvement of human welfare in the environment, and especially in developing countries. And we conduct this mission through strategic and applied research, through education and capacity building, and also by providing climate forecasts and information that really has an emphasis on the practical and verifiable utility of that information and through partnerships. So partnerships, um, and that's the sort of thing that we're gonna see and hear more about today, Partnerships uh, are uh, critical to all of the work that IRI does. Through the knowledge of our international staff, uh, we're very heavily engaged in strategic partnerships with governments, UN agencies, academic institutions, NGOs, the private sector that's interested in climate science and improvements in climate-related sectors. We're also uh, have very strong practical engagements and research activities with national meteorological agencies around the world. And these partnerships have given us an unparalleled access to local knowledge of the climate. In addition, we also work with our uh, colleagues in the Earth Institute and across Columbia University. And that's one thing that makes this uh, C4 collaboration really attractive, is that they collaborate with our collaborators. They're friends with our friends here in the Earth Institute. And that really just makes all of our work uh, that much stronger. What these partnerships uh, ultimately mean is that within our own institute, the IRI, we seek to cross these disciplinary boundaries and while advancing our own research on climate and, and sectoral science, uh, we can help to translate the results that are coming out of our collective and collaborative endeavors to really um, feed into tangible development opportunities on the ground. Behind that is something maybe not all of you, maybe not most of you have heard about, but should. Uh, behind a lot of that work is one of our crown jewels, it's the IRI data library. The data library is a unique capability that allows one to manage, analyze, visualize, and share uh, vast amounts of, of data, climate data, environmental data, other data sources, with operational and research communities around the world. And this is, has been really fundamental. Our uh, regional and sectoral science at IRI makes extensive use of this capacity and has really driven a lot of the user-oriented innovations in it. So <clears throat> Walter Baitgen, who's here with us today, he is the head of our regional and sectoral research effort. 
And he, together with other IRI researchers, together with our colleagues at the Agriculture and Food Security Center here at Earth Institute, and also the Earth Institute Center for Environmental Sustainability, have really been instrumental in uh, building and strengthening our partnership with C4 and our advances in the science and service of linking climate with ecosystems and forests. So we are truly grateful for this opportunity, for the opportunity that this meeting provides to, uh, to recognize the value of our partnerships, of uh, the value of our core mission, and its relevance into society. I'm very confident that the discussions that we hear today will just provide additional motivation for our work. And I once again want to thank C4 and my Earth Institute colleagues and again our distinguished panel of speakers um, for the opportunity to be part of this dialogue and, and to learn from you all. Thank you.